We have more breaking news. Two firefighters injured battling a boat fire in St. Clair Shores. 7 Action News reporter Aaron Baskerville is live at the scene. Aaron, what can you tell us? Hey, Stephen and Heather, right now we are across the way from the Jefferson Beach Marina in St. Clair Shores, and there's still an active scene. If you can take a look behind me, you can still see some of the flashing lights. Firefighters have been out here for several hours, like you said, fighting a boat fire. We know that two firefighters have been injured. They've been taken to the hospital right now. We do not know their condition. You are looking at photos we got our hands on. One is from earlier tonight. You can see the boat, just a ball of flames from across the way. Another is from a restaurant at the Jefferson Beach Marina. You can kind of see that thick black smoke moving across the water. A witness out here, actually the owner of this marina, Miller Marina, told us he believes that a power line somehow got loose, hit a sailboat, and that's what sparked a fire with one boat, possibly two boats. A source is telling us that two firefighters somehow got shocked, and then they were sent to the hospital. We believe they're doing okay right now. We had a chance to talk to the owner of this nearby marina. Here's what he told us just about a half hour ago. Definitely one boat on fire, a lot of smoke, a lot of flames. The wind's been carrying the flames away. So very fortunate situation that only one or two boats got burnt with this high wind. It could have been a lot worse. You heard him right there. He said it's a very uh, a volatile situation, so to speak, with all of these boats close to each other. They all could have easily gone up in flames, and thankfully no one else was injured out here. But it looks like that scene over there is starting to wrap up. They've been out here for several hours. Unfortunately, right now we're hearing two firefighters have been sent to the hospital. Hopefully we'll get a condition check on them real shortly. But for now, we are live in St. Clair Shores, Aaron Baskerville, 7 Action News. All right, Aaron, thank you so much for that. That live report we have